Today is the first day of Metro Accelerator. Ten teams are coming together to make their startup even better. And the grand finale of today's first day at Metro Accelerator is cooking together at the Metro Academy. So what you see behind us is ten teams working with the perfect ingredients, perfect recipes. But there's one question left. What is the perfect recipe for startup success? We will find that out now. Chef number one to add the perfect ingredients to our startup recipe is Arne from Hortsport. Arne, what would you put into the recipe for a perfect startup success? Uh, my ingredient would be a minimum viable product, meaning that reduce your product to the minimum, that it's still functioning, and that's where you should start. Ah, pretty interesting. So it's uh, lean cuisine, so to say. That's, that's yeah, molecular cuisine if you want. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Let's see what the others have to say about this. Next one to tell us the perfect recipe for startup success is Lee from Pantry Co. So what would you put into the recipe for a perfect startup? Well, it's got to be uh, a, good, uh, a good dose of determination okay. and uh, beer. And, and beer. That you're from Australia. That's, that's yeah. ex that explains why there has to be beer in a recipe. Well, and it, it makes 150 hour work weeks, you know. Yeah, it, it makes it easier. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's it's uh, you sh probably share that with the Germans. They also, they also uh, think that life is better with a bit of beer. Absolutely. Well, I was planning to uh, maybe take three months um, of you know no beer completely, but uh, we're yeah, in no, Germany. It doesn't work in Germany. Yeah. Welcome to <laughs> Germany. First day at, at Metro Accelerator. Welcome. <laughs> it's good to be here. Okay, Carlos from Cheerfy is preparing the fish and is really busy with it, but you cannot be busy enough not to answer our question. What is in your recipe for perfect startup success? Well, certainly uh, something that is difficult in practice uh, is uh, focus. When you are in a startup, you have plenty of directions uh, to be taken and it's very important to nail down uh, one particular um, aspect that you are trying to fix. So focus is critical. Uh, a second one would be uh, simplicity. Mm -hmm. Keep it simple in every single aspect uh, from your product, uh, from your marketing, uh, let's say, compelling message, uh, from the way you work, don't complicate things uh, in your processes, uh, etc. And the third one, and the last one, I think, is uh, perseverance. Okay. Uh, this is a sort of bumpy road. Uh, you'll have for sure great days, bad days, but you have to keep pushing. And uh, well, that's something you have to remember every single day. We collected three ingredients for startup success, and we'll move on. So let's find out what's what's more in the recipe for startup success. Thanks a lot, Carlos. Thank you. Is it maybe stinky garlic? Kane from Pantry Co. Hello, hello. Well, welcome. Guten Abend. Guten Abend. Yeah, and, and you can add your secret recipe, uh, or your secret ingredient for startup success. What would you put into the perfect recipe for a successful startup? Oh, great question. I don't think you can pass up team dynamics. You know, I love working with my team and okay. we can create some magic and we say, uh, you know, food makes, you know, brings people together and that's magic. So I think that the answer to that would have to be team dynamics. Where are you guys from? We're from Melbourne, Australia. Melbourne, Australia. We flew uh, 24 hours uh, to get here. A little bit jet lagged at the moment, yeah. but um, we made it and we're so excited to be here. So it's, we're alive and kicking, but extremely jet lagged. Yeah, <laughs> and enjoy the jet lag and see, see what you're having for breakfast, like breakfast your time. You're having French garlic for breakfast. How do you like that? If it's made by a premier dicer right here, then I'll eat it. it I am <laughs> super excited to be here. <laughs> very good. Yeah, so well, uh, that sounds really good. And uh, yeah, enjoy the breakfast. Thank you very much. <laughs> he is adding potatoes to the pot, but will Jens, the guy from Techstar, is also add a secret ingredient to our perfect recipe for a successful startup. If you had one choice to add to the perfect recipe, Jens, what would it be? Cheese. Cheese. We, we haven't had that before. Do, do successful startups need cheese? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, ask, ask him. Do you need cheese? Do you need Absolutely. cheese? Absolutely. Cheese and red wine 
I repeat, red wine is very, very important. And white wine. And white wine. Lovers of red wine, white wine and cheese coming together. Well, And, and rosé champagne over there. And rosé champagne, it's okay. It's a, beautiful, uh, it's a beautiful mix. Okay. <laughs> yes, Al, you, you, at least you'll have a lot of fun. If it's going to end up successfully, I don't know, but uh, fun, fun is guaranteed. <laughs> the meat experts, Ivo and Alex from Reputize. Guys, what would be your favorite recipe ingredient for startup success? I believe the main thing is uh, people and timing. And timing, okay. Yeah. So it's, it's a bit like, like meat that you are taking care of right now. It's also really important. Like you don't want it too dry, you don't want it too raw. It's uh, timing. What, what do you think? Uh, you also <laughs> need a good oven. Yes, they are a perfect team. See, they think the same. It's, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, um, persistence okay. is um, definitely a thing that, um, that you should be excellent in. Okay. Persistence and uh, self-confidence. Mm -hmm. Pretty difficult to say. There is no formula for success. That's the bad thing. <laughs> So oh no! Your own way. <laughs> Destroying all our dreams. No, no formula for success. Well, I do not believe these guys. We are we are continuing our hunt for the secret formula for success. Join us. Earlier, you said the perfect recipe for startup success is uh, contains cheese, but maybe it's just tons of pressure. Welcome to the accelerator. <laughs> Welcome to the accelerator. Where pressure is only pressure is Jens' second name. No, I don't put pressure on the teams. You don't? No. <laughs> they put so much pressure on themselves. They actually need to take the pressure off. Okay, so maybe maybe it's also part of the success that you don't don't put too much pressure on yourself. No, it's it's actually I'm, you know I'm the waste disposal guy. I I, I I take the trash out. That's basically my job. What is the perfect ingredient for startup success? Oh, well, sorry. What is the perfect ingredient for startup success? We are still on our quest to find that out. Damien from Venue 10 in the house, what would you put into your favorite recipe for startup success? Definitely some chocolate. Uh, other than that, just uh, total single mindedness, uh, complete perseverance. Listen to what people tell you, ignore a good part of it, but do listen to some of it and constantly reinvent yourself, your project, and your skill set. And never think you know it all because you know nothing. Elizabeth from Techstars, she might know the answer what the ingredient for startup success is. Is it maybe chocolate? I, I guess so, I, really. I would say it's, it's, it's tons of chocolate, like, like in here. It's, like, see, ah. it's chocolate. See, it's at least yeah. really, really yummy. Maybe more but, chocolate. Yeah, like, like honestly, what, what do you think when you create a recipe for a successful startup, what would you put into this recipe? Um, a team that works well together. Okay. Like all the ingredients in this wonderful chocolate? Exactly. See? Okay. See? Maybe it's it. Mark from Resmit, what is your perfect ingredient for startup success? Uh, effectiveness in the team. So that everybody is really working effective. Um, looking at the time, doing things very fast. Cool stuff, thanks a lot. You're welcome. Okay guys, one thing is sure, we have found the perfect recipe for the perfect dinner. If these guys out there also have the perfect recipe for the perfect successful startup, we'll find that out with you. We'll take you on a 13 week long journey with Metro Accelerator and we'll go with these startups through their way to success. We'll see how maybe their business model changes, how their sales process changes. We'll see a lot and we'll follow these startups. So go with us on a journey, follow us the 13 weeks to startup success. I'm happy if you stay with the channel and if you um, see what stuff these startups are experiencing um, see you in the next video. Bye-bye and guten Appetit.